Hey YouTube, it's Sabrina. So don't forget to like, share, subscribe to my channel, comment, um, to win a chance to be a part of my manifestation ritual. Okay guys, and my releasing ritual, I'm gonna pick someone every month. So if you got a comment, I will tell you to email me if you want, okay? Right, so I think I'm gonna do a collective message. Yeah. Let's see. Angels and guys of the highest so I like. What is in the collective's energy right now, currently? What is the current energy? So you guys. I feel like you guys are focused on money right now, making money. Some of you guys are trying to um, see what you're going to do next when it comes to um, a business or um, a, a project, a plan, something creative. Um, a lot of you guys, it's like new business ideas. Um, for others of you, it's just like managing your money better. Yeah, some of you guys, you need to hold on to your finances or you're looking at ways to hold on. Some of you guys, honestly, um, it's in here that don't look back at um, some of you guys, you could have spent some type of money or whatever. It's saying don't look back. You have everything that you need. Like you're, you're, you have everything that you need. Yeah. Some of you guys could be uh, very intuitive, very empathic. Um, somebody could be a CNA or um, a RN. Um, I'm getting doctors. Uh, somebody could be like a home health aide. Somebody that takes care of others. Um, I'm also getting... Um, somebody could be a lifeguard as well. So... It's saying here that you have everything that you need. Um, just get back to work. Some of you guys, get back to work. Yeah, you're going to get public recognition for your work. Some of you guys, you need to work on your intuition. Some of you guys are very intuitive. And um, you could be psychics and mediums. It's saying here that you're going to get a new business idea. Some of you guys will be dealing with a Scorpio because the Cajun Wands came out with um, the Tower and the Death card in reverse. So it's saying here that, um, who is this page of fucking wands? Cause this bitch is, I don't like this bitch. I don't like this girl over here. 10 of pentacles in reverse. See, this queen of swords is a petty ass bitch. This is somebody that you don't talk to, communicate with. This bitch is over here strategizing on how to make you lose out on your money how to keep you stagnant in a situation and um, also how to keep you unstable basically with the tower here. They want you to, like this person here, why is the page of wands here? Uh, you're independent, you have creative ideas, you're a business owner, you're a very independent person, queen of pentacles. Be dealing with a Virgo Taurus Capricorn, you could be dealing with an Aquarius, a Libra, a Gemini. Um, hmm. This King of Swords is here. Um, you could have blocked this King of Swords. This King of Swords, you could have blocked them on your phone. Some of you guys, this person wants to um come and balance things out with you. There's a high priestess here. That is having a lot of sleepless nights. This person could have done a lot of spell work on you. Now she's having sleepless nights and now she's the Page of Pentacles. She could be, she's definitely getting tarot readings on you and doing magic. The Emperor, she's doing magic on this father figure here. It's a lot of spell work being done on him um, and a lot of tarot readings. He could be feeling a lot of negative projections. Maybe his back is hurting. Um, definitely headaches, migraines sleepless nights not being able to sleep so i'm getting that this 
high priestess is the one that is feeling this um there's an imbalance here in the home in a home situation so somebody here could be paying someone that they're not supposed to pay or paying someone too much money things need to be balanced out here um somebody needs to consult a lawyer because the king of swords is a lawyer is a lawyer with a justice card that's a court case somebody could have some type of mental disorder bipolar um somebody, you could be dealing with a pisces cancer scorpio Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Somebody, let's see, this is an ex-lover that you were dealing with. This person could, is very much obsessed with you. This person is receiving judgment. Um, this person could have juggled you in the past with someone else. So I see that you could have been this person's twin or you could have been just this person's like, um, you were a soulmate to this person, but you weren't a karmic. This person was dealing with a karmic energy. Um that basically was like working through them in order to get to you. They're receiving judgment now. And this could be from, from having a baby with your person or something like that. They have a baby with your person and they're receiving judgment. Um, yeah, this person juggled you in the past. Hierophant. So now this person, see, this is somebody that is not like, is, is trying to get out of following limited belief patterns like marriage like you know what i'm saying this is someone that um maybe they were in a marriage and they want to get a divorce and get separated that's something that's unconventional like something that people you know normally try not to do but um this person is is tired of following this religion or this um conditioned behavior this um this shit that he's stuck in He's juggling between the spiritual and the physical about this relationship. This is a this is a marriage. So someone is trying to stop this empress from getting um, this offer, and they're trying to maybe make you lose a lot of money, lose a lot of money and stability. This person doesn't want you to start over with this King of Wands. It could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So this is someone that's very passionate about you. But it's saying here that maybe they're doing spell work on this person's money. So they're going to lose out on a lot of money. And then this person is going to come back. And they're going to try to win you back after they, their money is gone. That's fucked up. I'm dead. Yeah, look, after their money is gone, <laughs> they're going to try and come back because they're going to be left out in the cold. Yeah, because you left them. All right. Now this person's going back to you. Nothing but a backpack on. Mm-hmm. Yep. So this person could be trying to move. Or create illusions to move or something like that. Somebody's moving. All right. So let's see. Okay. <sighs> somebody could be, like, trying to stop somebody from moving or something like that. It could be with this person that they want to be with. You deserve love. You are loved by your angels, your ancestors, and God. They're saying stay positive. Because divine timing, it, shit, it could be now. Worth waiting for. You guys are in separation from your person right now. They're dealing with a false person. Um, and they're having problems. See, this person doesn't want to put things to rest. They don't want to end the relationship here with this family. They have a family. But the thing is, somebody's just waiting for some type of information. Or they're, yeah, they're waiting for some type of information. Um, they're waiting for their ships to come in. They're waiting for, like, somebody could be waiting for a bank deposit. They could be waiting for money. They could be waiting for, I don't know. Um, somebody could work a commission job. Love yourself first. It says you decided to love yourself first because this person was dealing with um, a main female and this, this female here needs to learn to love herself first. That's basically what they're saying. Mature man. See, this is, this somebody here lacks self-love and they have a baby with someone that's much older than them. 
someone here is dealing with somebody's father or uncle or something like that they have a baby with this child that's way um i said with this with this with this child with this man they're going to court or something like that and there's like two lovers here there's definitely two different lovers here because there's a main male and then there is a, a main female i didn't take out main male is it on the floor yep main male's on the floor okay so there's a main male here and then there's a mature man somebody's going to court for child support and it's saying here that this female was dealing with both of them let your friends help you mm. somebody here is asking for support from other people it could be a lawyer it could be their friends and family and stuff like that they're asking for support or they could need your support um you're expecting this person to maybe come towards you because this person is going to need your help something like that what else current energy yeah this is an unrequited love here so let's see unrequited love and honeymoon so this person has unfinished business with you you could be this person's new lover they could be dealing with the old karmic energy you know and they want to reconcile with you this so they could have been in a relation with you in the past and now they want to come back or something like that yeah they, they want they have a home with you they, they feel like you're home to them they want to come back to you 11 22 when i said that look up that angel number they feel like you're a part of their um their spiritual journey their pathway you're a part of their destiny they're very passionate about you they want they definitely want to have sex yeah very soon they want to come towards you very soon they're probably going to message you dm you within the next um couple weeks um mm. yeah retreat true love finances and very soon so this person is dealing with money issues or they're like working on finances and stuff like that but after they disconnect from from um the situation or something like that so they could be trying to leave a job or change jobs or open up a business or something um also they're working out finances with uh baby mama or baby father this person wants to disconnect from the world with you they want to move away like somebody wants to move away they're working on their finances adjudication somebody's receiving judgment about this gift now it could be like this person bought something for somebody and um now they're going to court and stuff like that maybe this person's going through a divorce they're going through a divorce and they could have gifted this person something or oh, um they could have gifted this person something and now they want it back or they want the money back or something like that bad health somebody could have gave somebody an std so this karmic gave your person an std release your ex that's why they released them yeah they, so they probably didn't tell you this this is someone that they have a family with they definitely got an std with um by that person privileged lady the little unexpected income for yourself wedding so th they were dealing with this person who thought she was a privileged lady or they could want to marry a privileged lady so they they want to marry a privileged lady here you could be getting some unexpected income because you freed yourself from the situation somebody here is taking back control of their life and they want to go towards somebody so i'm getting like they want to go towards somebody they're taking back control of their life and someone here should be expecting some type of unexpected income okay because someone is now taking back control of their life and they want to come towards you maybe with a gift because this person here is in despair um see this person here so i'm getting someone that um they were they were helping the less fortunate and that's what they get the less fortunate that's what they said yep so i want them reverse so now this person has um to work extra hard this could be this karmic she has to work extra hard now because she doesn't have any good luck anymore yeah four four it was 1404 when i said that this person was doing mass spell work on you and now they don't have any good luck they done suck all the luck out of them what the fuck if this person like was a lucky person before or they like made money fast yeah all the money is going out down the drain they was paying for mad spell work or something like that or they was buying mad dumb shit the fuck yeah somebody here could have been a scammer now they got to deal with the police somebody here is getting caught for scamming or something like that um this could be like someone also that yeah somebody here they're, they're a scammer for a living or they like um somebody here could also be like a sugar baby or something and they scam like they 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 scam older men oh shit and they do spell work and love spells on them to get their money look 
to get somebody here did spell work to get an engagement um or to get married to somebody and this shit is falling apart this shit is falling apart bro somebody did spell words and and then now they're thinking about getting engaged to somebody else they want to get engaged to somebody else they're leaving they want to change who the fuck they're dealing with look change they want to pack their bags and leave now the spell work wore off they, they want to go towards somebody they already know they, they, that they met um before in the past yeah they want to they have to tell something to this person they they were lying before or they have to tell this truth to this person that they they can't stop thinking about them and they want to go towards them now look yeah they're gonna extend their heart their lighthearted energy to you they're gonna flirt with you they're gonna text you they're gonna call you they're gonna be like can i tell you something da, 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 my deepest feelings i really you know i do love you i i just um don't know how to tell you or express it before and i'm leaving this, this bitch because i can't stop thinking about you da, da, da. that's what this person's gonna come with see there's a community as of childish ass motherfuckers it's a bunch of grown people too with control issues there's a community of these fucking people trying to control your person and you guys are both calling each other in and this person no longer wants to work on the relationship with that person that's why they're mad because this person here was being um a false person this person could have like they acted like they were privileged but they weren't like this person could have said they, they made, made a lot of money or something like that but they lied they're really um or if they did have a lot of money they're in poverty now or something because they were um wearing a false mask they were a false person from the beginning like i said they were a false person Wow, some of you guys, you gotta take. Some of you guys are gonna take somebody back, but this man then lost all his money behind this karmic. Somebody wants you to take them back. See with the journey, trust, forgive and learn, marriage. Some of you guys, you were married to this person and they were dealing with someone on the side, and you've been separated for a while, and now this person wants to come back. Pay attention to the red flags. Someone here wants to have a heart to heart conversation with you, and they're sending you signs and synchronicities as well that, to tell you that they're coming. And this wealthy man here now he's he's has um money issues someone here knows that it's not safe to love this person here that's codependent and they're not their soulmate they know that now that the, this person is not their soulmate you could be like you're not they're not communicating with this person anymore or you know this is going to happen in the near future they don't want to communicate with this person anymore they're not attractive to this person they feel like they this person stole shit from them um, they feel like this person stole time, energy, money, all that shit. They was stealing. They're a thief. This person is a thief. They do they do it for a living. They court older women or older men. So this could be also like a sugar daddy or a sugar baby. Or this is also like um, sugar daddy, sugar baby. This could be a pimp. A pimp or something. Like this person like... This could be like... See, this is, this is giving me that movie. What's that movie? ashtray bitch <laughs> this is a whole setup here this is a whole setup like this person um so this could have happened to to this mature woman here where you were dealing with a younger energy that was courting you and stuff like that because you have maybe you, you you know you have a good job and stuff like that and so this person here they could have scammed you for money and um yeah this, this person could have got married to you for money so this could be like immigration like getting married to somebody um for them to get their papers so somebody here now wants to leave and it's after because this person here was mad draining they were hella draining like they drained them for for everything now this person is like working extra hard now to get it back and this mature woman here you want to somebody wants to court this mature woman um they want to express their love they feel like this is a past life relationship so if you was dealing with that karmic energy or your person was, they're now leaving or you're leaving. Because they know this person's not their soulmate. They don't want nothing to do with this person. This person, like, they found out about some type of deceptive energy that they was dealing with. They found out about something. One of their clients or one of the people that they stole from or, or scammed or robbed or whatever. Ooh, it's getting juicy. It's getting juicy. Yeah, no. This is like... So, definitely somebody got married and they've been doing love spells on this person. 
to keep the marriage or to even get married in the first place. So I'm getting that this person is has been a false ass bitch from the, from the beginning. They're a fake ass bitch. Like this kid is probably this not even this person's. It's um so, someone that is older. Or if you're an older person, it's a younger man. Um, this could also be somebody that you know, somebody that's in your family um, or a friend. But yeah, that's the collective energy for right now. But my readings are timeless. So, you know, this could happen. This week, this be happening right now as for current energy. But this could also, like, you know, um, happen in your future or already happen. Thank you, guys. See you later.